Dwolem, your team comes out with a lopsided win over our Weaver here tonight. What were some things you really focused on that you tried to get uh, executed out there on the floor? Well, number one, get the ball inside right away. Uh, we wanted to establish the inside play, um, get the ball into Madison, and you know, hopefully build a lead on that. And that's kind of what we did. Slow start, kind of disappointed in that, but uh, I thought the girls, second half especially, uh, really played pretty well. Free throw shooting, I want to say it was something along the lines of 13 of 19 for the game. and. Second half, you were 7 of 7 at one point. Uh, pretty good numbers for you guys. Yeah, second game in a row, we've been over 50%. We struggled from the line, so something we've really been focused on in practice, doing a bunch of different drills, trying to help that out. And it's good to see that we can show the girls that it's getting better. It was 7 7 early on, kind of just back and forth, trading buckets, and then you went on an 11 to 2 run to end the first quarter. What were some things you adjusted to really get on track? You know, the biggest thing is we just came out flat. Um, you know what? I think part of that was without our weaver without Danner. I think our girls relaxed a little bit. Uh, you know, I've been preaching to them all week that she was going to play. And, um, unfortunately, she didn't get a play. But uh, um, so I think that was, had a little bit to do with it. And, but it's kind of been us. We've got to get off these slow starts in the first quarter. We got to get something figured out for that. Got quite a few steals tonight. Got quite a few offensive rebounds as well. How important is that to get those extra opportunities to shoot? That's huge. You know, and Madison does a great job on the old boards, and then everybody contributes in the steal department for us. And, like you said, gets us extra opportunities and helps us get in transition as well. We had four players in double figures, so let's just get a comment on each of them. Uh, 19 points to lead the way for Felicity Jackson, as she was pretty efficient on the offensive end. Yeah, absolutely. You know, Felicity, she got to the basket, hit a few jumpers too, and then I think she made her free throws. I think she might have been perfect from the free throw line tonight. And uh, 18 points for Madison Gettler. She got to the line a lot too. I think she had six free throws alone in the first quarter, finishes with 18 points. Yep, and you know, I'm going to be hard on Madison, but I think she could have done a lot better. She missed a few bunnies tonight. Um, I think if she had to do that over again, she would have had a much bigger night. Um, you know, as a sophomore, she really needs to understand that each time she gets the ball is a huge opportunity for our team to be successful, so she needs to take care of business for us. Macy Tickner ends up with 12 points for you. Yeah, Macy. Macy did a good job. Right away, she missed a few. Um, kind of had a reminder, you got to go up strong every time. And in the second half, I really thought she did a much better job with that. Paige McAfee got a couple to go from the outside there towards the end and ends up with 10. Paige is the wild card for us. We need her to, to make those outside shots for us to be successful. So very good to see Paige knock a couple of those down in the second half for us. So it was a game where you were able to get a lot of players in, and you got them in not just in garbage time, too. You got them in early in the contest. So how important is that? That's huge for us, too, especially we're fighting the flu bug here. We've had a lot of girls missing school. Uh, missing practice, so it was good for us to give some people some breaks and uh, maybe run the sickness out of a few of them too. Where do you go from here? Some things you want to try and build on moving forward? Go nope. take care of the ball. I didn't think we had very many turnovers tonight, um, so that's going to be huge for us Tuesday when we go see Sparty. So take care of the ball and just do, need to do a better job finishing inside and keep continuing knocking down our free throws. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.